Not many people can say that they helped Hollywood legend and Oklahoma native Ron Howard come up with an idea for a movie. A Broken Arrow man can. Two News reporter Brandon Richards live in South Tulsa tonight. Well, Karen, what's really unique about this film is how it came about. The inspiration didn't come from a book or a real life situation, but from eight simple yet powerful photographs. If a picture is worth a thousand words, then eight pictures are worth an entire Hollywood movie. At least that's the case for the new Ron Howard film entitled When You Find Me. It's a story about two young girls that lose their mother you know, very tragically, and uh, it's, it's how they deal with that death in, in two extremely different ways. But the plot isn't what makes this film unique. It's how it came about through a user-generated photo contest by Canon. Ron Howard and, and Canon collaborated to invite the whole public to uh, submit their real imaginative photos into categories to make up a story. Broken Arrow photographer Chris Winter submitted this photo, an image of the 51st Street date at Memorial Park Cemetery. You know, the clouds were really gorgeous and, and the gate they kind of fit the gate it was real ominous looking so I hopped out of my car and took the picture more than 96,000 photos were submitted Howard himself chose the eight winning photos that he believed would create a powerful story after the film was made Chris attended the world premiere in New York with Ron Howard and his daughter who directed the film uh, we went to an after party after the film and Gracious, super gracious guy. Real, uh, he's a real Oklahoma guy, you can tell. Each winner also gets the opportunity to show a special screening in their hometowns. Oklahomans who saw it gave it a thumbs up. The movie was very touching. Yes, yes, it was. Oh, it was wonderful, yeah. Kind of makes you be proud of someone that, you know, took such a wonderful piece of art for, from Oklahoma. Now, if you weren't able to make it out here to the premiere, Canon will post the film onto their YouTube channel next week. Live in South Tulsa, Brandon Richard, 2 News, works for you. So it sounds like a good movie, it does it? It does. Can't wait to see it. Well,